Right, folks, welcome back to another episode today, taking on Crystal Palace in the FA Cup and Arsenal in the Premier League. So two games off camera, 2-1 uh, victory over Fulham and a 1-1 draw against Liverpool, unfortunately. Should have won that game. Um, yeah, a bit annoying, but still. I think we should be all right. We're going to play Terry in goal. Yanazai is going to come in for Balatic. Orellana can play for Koulibaly. We'll start Palacio instead. Otherwise, team is going to be normal. So, Terry, De Silva, Luis, Sergio, Walker, Peters, Halliday, Orellana, Ferran, Doku, Yanazai, Palacio. Though, I'm thinking actually, let's chuck in Mimit Tasky for Sergio. Why not? He may struggle to see out the game, but it's only the FA Cup, so I am not. I, I would prefer to win at least this round, um, especially because Crystal Palace are a championship club at this stage in the save, and also because we keep getting knocked out in cup competitions at the at our entry stage, basically. So if we could stop doing that, it would um, <laughs> it would be very good. Be very disappointing if um, we couldn't do that. In what two or three seasons in a row? If we don't, uh, if we were to get knocked out now, it would be two or three seasons. Let's see, what is Yandro or Alana up to? He's gonna score, thank fifth goal of the season for Orlana. Hasn't played too many games, mostly coming off the bench and playing in some sort of rotation role, but still managed to score a Good amount of goals. And a key rotation player for us would be pretty pretty buggered if we didn't have a, a player like him on the bench or someone in the team that we could chuck into the squad and you know he's going to have a good game. So, stoked to have him around. What else is he going to do? He's giving it off to, to Silva now. He's going to whip in the cross, but it's not going to go anywhere except down to Halliday. We're going to start the attack again. Back to the keeper, so even more starting the attack again. <laughs> All right, Halliday, what do you want to do? Up to Yanazai. Get it through to Orellana again. Back to Halliday. To Ferran over the top. Heads on from Doku. Silver. It's a bit of a scrappy goal, but it's been disallowed anyway, so... Offside. We don't need to see it. That's all right. Still one go up. Again, as I wins the header off to Palacio, off to Doku. But wasted opportunity, easily saved from the Palace keeper. All right, first highlight from uh, after half time, and oof, Crystal Palace have scored. Muhammad Ahmed. It's unfortunate, we're pretty much far, just less than five minutes after half time and we've conceded. Not ideal, should be uh, pretty gutted that we're not more, more than, uh, we haven't scored more than one goal, we should definitely be doing better. Ferran's not having his greatest game, so that's going to be a blouser change on the bench. He'll come on. Metesky hasn't been up to much. Halliday, great little tackle. I'm not sure how it managed to do that, but cool. Palacio gets wrecked by Sanderson. And they are going to be 2-1 uh, up now. We will berate that. Is it offside? No, didn't think so. Berate the team, because that is um, far from what we want. And final two changes will be uh, Sturgio and Markovic up top. Because we need to get something from this game, and we need to get something now. 
Otherwise, it is going to be an embarrassing knockout in the FA Cup yet again. Let's encourage the team. Come on, boys. What are you doing? Ten shots, four on target. Just no one wants to create a goal from anything. Can we get this launch a counter attack? Take it to a, possibly a replay or extra time. I don't even know. FA Cup normally has replays, I believe. Which is an ideal. We don't want a replay. We shouldn't need to have a replay against a team like Crystal Palace, but we're still losing to Crystal Palace. And we're going to. It's going to end 2 1, isn't it? <coughs> highly, highly embarrassing. Highly embarrassing. That's ridiculously. Kind of no complaints. We deserved better. Yeah, not happy in this lot. It's disaster. It's the team is allergic to cup competitions. Let's have a look, eh? Yes, Benfica, you can have prior on loan. Let's, uh, let's go. FA Cup third round. Let's just have a look from the last season. We lost to Fulham. Yep, cool. Uh, and then we lost to Watford the season before that. Let me just see. Then we lost to Chelsea the season before that in the third round. So that's one, two, three, four, five, four seasons. Okay, and then four seasons in a row we've lost in the third round ridiculous okay well this is not ideal Manchester City have made an offer 89 mil for and I'm going to convince them to stay just to win a title I think we can win the title this season I'm happy to wait cool with, uh, we've set our bit. Hopefully that's the end of it. Bam. Need to win the league now. Okay, this is an interesting one. <clears throat> we've got an offer in for Max Norman Williamson. Now, his contract is expiring this season and he won't sign a new deal. We signed him for 25 mil and we could sell him to Tottenham for 10.25 which would give us at least some money back. So, and they also include the percentage profits. We could either lose them on a free, we could sell them for less than half of what we bought them for. I think I'm gonna, gotta have to accept it really. So, yeah. Hopefully then we can at least make some money back. Just before we get into the game, Max Norman Williamson has officially left the club to sign for Tottenham Hotspur for 10.25 mil. So it's unfortunate that they have recalled uh, Vazquez from his loan at uh, Inter since he wasn't getting any game time. He only played two games there, so we have recalled him. So that is fine. We're not lacking in depth centre backs or anything. Not that Williamson really got to play too much. Uh, unfortunately for him, he played about eight goals. No, you're not buying him. Reject all transfer offers. Doesn't matter. Too bad. You can't have him. He's agreed to stay with us. As long as we win the league. All these uh, Chinese Super League clubs are also trying to buy my defenders too. Uh, he is not happy. Okay, my thanks, sir. That's completely fine. Thought I gave you enough game time, but clearly not. If you want to be sold, they want 60 million for Carl Bevan. I don't think he's 60 million worth. So, no. Uh, 20 mil, sure. 60, no. Not for me, sorry. Not in the slightest. Kula Bali is away on um, international duty. Let's get Vasquez right straight back in the team. And... We're going to play Sar as well before he packs his sad. Juliano is going to come in. Markovic is going to go down to B. 
Finch and Staminek can come in. Anyone tired? Terry's going out for Big Low. Walker Peters there. There we go. That is the team. Big Low, De Silva, Saar, Vazquez, Walker Peters, Halliday, Orellana, Ferran, Doku, Yanazai, and Kuliano. Except it's actually going to be Blatic, not Yanazai. And now we're coming in. Bingo. Order number him up. Let's get into the game. Big game against Arsenal. Well, it's not really a huge... Not, it's not in the grand scheme of things, considering they are somewhere down the bottom part of the table. But still, you can only beat who's put in front of you on the day. You still have to play 90 minutes of football, and you can still get a win. So that's exactly what we need to do. We need to win. We want to keep our title aspirations alive. I can't quite remember how many points we are were ahead, but I think even a... Well, we've only lost one game. Drawn two or three, possibly four games now. I think it's three. So, we haven't been doing too badly, but we don't want to bottle our title chances because we've done so well to come this far as Doku... Oh, what a save from Drakowski. Doku had a magnificent chance there. Gonna whip it across, it's gonna be headed away from Arsenal. I'm not even gonna try and pronounce that fella's name. I'll pronounce McKinney, because that's easy. Gwindoozy. We are five points ahead of Tottenham in second, so we could make that a bit more. That would be lovely. How many? Five, six, seven, eight. Got eight points clear. Go 52. No, we'd go 50 points. No, we'd go to 51 because it's a draw. No, we'd go to 49. You imbecile. I can't do maths, guys. I can't do maths. Okay. <laughs> Pretty boring so far. Orlando gets tackled. I don't think that's in the penalty box. I think it is just going to be a free kick ref. But if you can give him a red card, that would probably help us out quite a bit as well. No penalty. Free kick. I'll take the penalty, though. No penalty. That's outside, yes. But free kick still. All good for us. Or Alana, what can you do here for us, mate? Oh, yes, of course. They've got Nicholas Sula in defence. Oh, what a tackle. Halliday, calm down, calm down, mate. That was horrific. Oh, Tottenham have now just gone um, one nil up, so <clears throat> not quite what you want to see. It's Orlana's. Oh, his head is saved. Come on, haven't been as clinical recently. I don't know what's happened. Sort of a downturn. Some of our results we seem to be conceding goals now, which we weren't before. Not creating as much chances as we used to. No, it doesn't seem... Earlier in the season, it seemed quite easy. I want to say that's like the right word. We just sort of come in, you'd sort of expect us to win. But now it's a bit, it's a bit harder now. Maybe the, the team's probably lacking a bit of focus. They're probably too overly confident. I'm not too sure. We need to get back into the swing of things. We need to get back into some wins. We need to keep the pressure. We need to try and win the league as early as possible. Keep winning games. No draws, no defeats. Keep winning games. Wrap up the league. Get as many points clear. And we'll be sweet. Then once the league is wrapped up, do what you want. <laughs> Uh, not ideal for, a, you know, it's not what you want to hear from your team. We'll just wrap up the league, guys, early, and then you can just do whatever you want. I mean, I don't know what you're up to there, Guiliano. Why on earth would you pass it back? I mean, lucky you still have the ball, but still. Walker Peters to Ferran. Take a shot, buddy. Oh, there we go. It's a goal for us. Balatic, he's probably offside. 
Hawk's Egg. Just give us the Gull Reef. Fire up, guys. Sort your fucking shit out. You're not performing the way I need you to. Guliano, you're getting off. Brand is there, Mark Ulvik. What can you do here, mate? We need the win. Let's go more direct. Shoot on site. Hit early crosses. See if that'll do anything. Orlana is uh, buggered, so Lowes is coming on for him. Here we go, Doku with a cross to Balatic. Oh my goodness. Even when Balatic plays, you used to think, oh yeah, he's going to play, he'll score, he'll set up an assist. Not, not anymore. He's kind of slowed down in recent times. and uh, He's a bit tired, so Yanazai can come off the bench. He had a fantastic season last season. His kind of powers have waned a bit. He's only a championship level player now, according to my scouts. And this could be two draws in the Premier League back to back. Seems like a wee bit of a rut that we're in, having lost to uh, Crystal Palace. Drawing against Liverpool. Now drawing against Arsenal. Nil, nil. God damn it. Not good enough. Especially these teams. These teams that are bloody... <clears throat> Look at Liverpool, 11th. Arsenal, 14th. How are we not taking advantage? Tottenham have got to win. They are only three points behind us now. Not good enough. Absolutely furious. Anyway. It's not been the greatest run of form ever since this... These two losses. The team is... Hmm. Anyway, regardless, I am going to play the rest of the... Uh, Month off camera, Watford, Sheffield, Aston Villa, Norwich, and Blackburn. They're all going to be off camera. I'll play the rest of January. Then we're coming back for a big game against Leicester and a big game against PSG in the Champions League. So look forward to seeing you all there. May, oh, we may, oh, do we want to do PSG and Man United? Not too sure. We'll figure that out when we come back anyway. Thanks a ton for watching, guys. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff uh, down below. And, uh, yeah, catch you in the next one. Peace.